size immediately. Okay, come on. Oh, the Social Democrats saved me now. That, that's, that's not very great. Uh, I might be becoming a subject. I might have to just accept it at some point. I ain't becoming a dominant power. Not around these lot. Like, let's look at this. Oh, God. Well, at least I'm isolated from them, so I can perhaps, I perhaps maybe may not get immediate success, per se, but I'll definitely get, oh. Well, these guys are perks, aren't they? That's amazing. Okay, let's see. You know what? Yeah, I'll be moving the one of my guys to do some spy work in the Yolda administration because uh, I kind of don't want to die. Anyway. I think I'm going to secure myself this point, and I'm going to make this a fortress world as well. Because, uh, eh. It's not very great having that feeling of, uh, death. Okay, what administrative stuff can I get? Well, I'm getting a galactic stock exchange at the capital, that's for sure. Yeah, I need a plan. I need a really, really, really good plan at this point. I mean, I have to align with one of these two. Okay, so they haven't got a strong fleet. Which is good for me. Because if they did, I'm pretty sure I'd be dead by now. So I've got a bit of time to gain resources and output. A bit of time to gather minerals, resources, anything that can be of use. Because the thing about me is that I'm gonna need a lot okay maybe okay and then what about here what about here please tell me okay no, no apparently not okay well, I'm getting another colony ship because I need to colonize that area immediately. And I need to get another bastion in the region. Because I do not want to be dead. 
This locks them away from my core territory. This will be a and also be a bet also be a bastion. This will become a trading hub. Actually, maybe, maybe, oh, now that I think about it, huh, now I'm not sure about taking this system, I'm not going to go that far, I don't want to annoy them, they are still hegemonic imperialists after all, they still will declare war on me if I do anything. Especially if I do anything stupid. Okay, wait, who's that? Okay, that, that, I, I really don't care too much about who's over there. However, I, oh, oh, that's just another bit of them, their territory. Hmm. I'm like Poland, aren't I? And I really dislike being like Poland in the, in the 16th century. 15th, in, in like, the 17th century, really. That's the proper way of putting it, but, uh I am going to so regret being here. I need to move, and I need to start claiming systems in the north quickly. Okay, a starport. That's the beginnings of a bastion at least. Uh here, missile battery. Wait, wait, hold on. Uh, let's see. Disruption field? Perfect. Just perfect. Just what I needed. Absolutely, unbelievably great. Ah. This system, though, hmm. Oh. The, these aren't good planets. I thought these might be Arctic worlds. Which would have been a great thing to me, at least. Ah, it's got a gas giant here. A frozen world. Mm. Monthly... Wait. Monthly strike corvette. Yeah, I'm gonna have to be a bullhawk, uh, bull, bullhawk against a lot of things. Okay, maybe this, this, and this. Hmm. Two strongholds. Greater than or equal to ten. Yes! Finally! 
I can get the planetary administration, which will make my life so much easier. Because what this planet is meant to be is I'm going to pit the classification. Now, the, class the, the designation of this planet, it's meant to be a fortress world. This planet is going to be a pin in the ass. Dominated by planetary defenses, bunkers, and strongholds, foreign invasion and civil unrest will prove difficult on this world. Yeah, I'm going to classify this as a fortress world because I need this place to be about as impenetrable as possible. It needs to be hard to kill because I am not going to be able to do much. Else, really? Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Well, up here. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, I'm building an alloy foundry because I need alloy. Okay, so where where is oh that's where it is. Okay, yeah, this system is going to have this. This this because I am not holding anything back for these lot. A tundra world. Perfect. They'll be, that'll be very hard to conquer. And I like how the two worlds which are meant to be basically fortress worlds are like the most painful type of worlds to possibly conquer in the, like in all of existence. Because they're tomb worlds. I mean, a tomb world's just a pain. Because, well, it's basically a world that's being destroyed. And I have now got a very strong garrison. That can be strengthened. Where are these? Displacement? Is that all we're doing here? Uh, let's do... Well, they'll at least be profitable. What? Okay. It's this one which I care about, and... There are not many other species which make sense, because we're basically fascist. 
So yeah, this this how kind of astounded. It kind of just astounds me just a bit. Anyway. Now I think about it, this is the this is the last system before they get into the nebula area, which will be a pain. Because the nebulas in this game basically just stop you from being able to do anything. Aside from maybe I don't know. Lose all your shielding in the entire world. Okay, they can't see that there is a nebula. Which is good for me because it means that I technically do have an advantage. And uh, now I'm going to do this. I am going to conquer this area, but hmm. Yeah, I feel like... Um, it's going to take a while, isn't it? Okay, city district generator generators. Well, amazing. Hmm. Hopefully these guys will be quite busy with these lot or the Cincinnati of something something because Well yeah, your economic power is overwhelming. Ah, uh, their fleet power is okay, but I see that there are hegemonic imperialists. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I think galactic force projection is quite important at this point. Uh, alloy. Hmm, interesting.
Okay. And rules from minus plus one. That should be pretty good. I like how this is a mining world. Ah, uh, I wouldn't. I get more mining districts. Ah, uh, okay, so that's what that is for. Hmm. Okay, defensively, I am probably the most powerful person here. Now, void biomes, because my core territory is no longer, doesn't really have any planets, however. Hmm. Ah, uh, Star Fortress. That time. Okay, I can at least do two. Wait, how much? Actually, now that I think about it, I need to check something. Hmm. Okay, how much does it block? 50 per, per one. Ah, so it halves the damage that they get to do. Army um, starting experience, so I'm going to build this. Mm. Yep. A stronghold. Because I want more men. Yep, and, uh, so yes, ah, finally I got to checking that system out. Hmm. Ocean world, ocean world, ah, good. What the? <laughs> okay, so... Could be an industrial world? What about you? Okay, you're definitely not being a lot. You're definitely not being an industrial world. Hmm. I think it's time to pit one here. Tropical world. Ooh, this is gonna be a pain for them. 
And I'm kind of happy it will be. Okay. Yeah, I am gonna... I'm getting all the slots for that planet because that planet's now got a multitude of uses for me. Hmm. Huh, yeah, this this is a complicated problem. Okay. So, what else do we have here? Uh... Yeah, I think I'm getting external vi vigilance now. Okay, so what else do I want? I think expansion should be good. That should really help me boost my power around my region. Okay, the Colossus Project. Whenever I'm ready, I can then begin building for that project. Hmm, what to get?
Okay, Master Builders, I'm pretty sure, should be my next goal. Because I need to be able to, like, sort of, like, plan this. So... Let's get one more. Hmm, impressive. Three Academy. Planetary Defense Armies 18 plus. Ah, uh, you gotta like it when. By the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics. Reached by Happyland only. Only through those L gates. Oh God. Of design iterations, we have had a lot of time on our hands. After all, sadly, non different of yours are not permanent aboard on board our ships. They were specifically designed with unique Disney suit physio physical physiology physiology in mind, and our visitors and visitors would only disrupt the work of their highly trained crews. Ah. Hmm. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. Okay, a planetary capital, which I'm then going to add another fortress to, because there is no way I'm letting them have this easy. They're going to have this painfully or not at all. Hmm. Yeah, this will be interesting. So far, I gotta say. Hmm.
Mm, examine the logs and I wish. Oh, I so wish I could do it. But I ain't pin a target on my back. Ooh. Mm, okay, so let's go for this. Oh! Oh, this is a second line, so... Hmm, what to have here? Well, I'm gonna make it that the initial infrastructure here isn't gonna be purely military, unlike my frontier military fortress world. So, yeah, this should be fairly interesting. Hmm. Unless they really, like, unless they really want to try it, but. Uh, okay, star base, new colonists, new colonies. Okay, Citadel. Oh, oh, oh god, that's some serious lag. It's got here. Oh, oh, yeah, this lag is bad. So, what do I want? Okay, and here we are going to see why not, yes, disruption field. I think if I can at least take up to the Chao system, that'll be good. After that, I'm stopping expansion and consolidating. Hmm.
Mmm, yep. I am slowly but surely conquering. Okay. Yes. <laughs> well, we definitely aren't uh, going exploring now. Hmm. Well, it looks like the shroud have uh quite successfully. Ooh, we must get to the bottom of this. I think I'm going for an embassy complex. It is the capital. I mean, your capital should always have those sort of like thing, the things which you really can't keep around boringly. Okay. So what do we have here? Star base influence cost reduced. Hmm. Okay, twenty five, which I should. 
probably have rather soon. Okay, so there. Okay, what what is this thing? Anyway, uh oh, it's a hyper relay. Mm. Requires having repaired or fully upgraded any mega structure. Mm. Yeah, I think a stronghold would do me well. And uh, what do we have here? Okay, wait, let me see. I want to see what have we got here. I think it is time. Okay, there we go. And defensive. Is this 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 should be very useful? These will be the bane of anyone trying to march through these areas. 
They're intended to be just another tool of defensive in my defensive arsenal, which should be pretty strong. Hmm. Okay, is reduced by 25. Hmm. Soon I shall have an artillerial asteroid artillery framework that should be able to be very painful. And speaking of that, Let's see, what have we got? Eager and an intellectual. Hmm. Well, that's good. Ally Giant 1. Yep, this time. I doubt anything is going to be able to break through this. Thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. Wait, thirty-eight. Come on, thirty-nine. Hmm. Gotta say, I've done quite a lot. I've managed to expand rather well. Next time, I'll be taking some new... Laying down some new colonies, but... That'll be in the next video. So anyway, I hope you, uh... Liked... This, uh... Video, so yeah. See you in the next one.